Well, here we are. It is Monday afternoon. As you can see, I'm headed across the mighty Ohio River. I'm having to go pick up my kid from college in his car. There are reasons. But we don't talk about everything on the YouTube channel. Uh, but no, he didn't drive today, so I got to go get him. Uh, it's been a wonderful weekend of sports. I uh, finally uploaded a video here on this Monday of in pretty much all of last week. And um, yeah, the Bengals won. The Bengals are going to the Super Bowl. It's a pretty exciting time in Cincinnati. Uh, the whole city is like turned out for the Bengals because it's been a long time. We've been to the Super Bowl twice, which is two more times than like four NFL <laughs> teams. Uh, we have one never, which is also a pretty small company, that a team that's never, ever won a Super Bowl. But we're feeling pretty good about it. Um, it was a pretty mellow work day after the stress of the past couple of weeks of having to get a lot done. Once I got that stuff done, there's a little pause before the more next stuff has to get done, uh, which is good for me. Yeah, okay, so that's why I wasn't able to edit and uh, throw the video up there during my lunch hour. So. All right, so go uh, go watch that if you haven't watched it. If you've now finding me here on YouTube, and then we'll uh, we'll talk at another time. All right, I gotta pay attention to the road. Today. Well, there you go. <laughs> I don't know which is the top and the bottom. My ignition coil has arrived. Uh, here I am holding the phone with the wrong hand. I'm not sure I can do this while I'm uh, filming. Oh look, I can. Boom. That ought to be enough. Oh, yes, I am filming with the correct hand. I'm trying to use my dominant hand. So, you know the deal. This is my replacement um, ignition coil. So, what I'm going to do now, I'll install this one on the car and then. Um, return the other one and get my money back. Thank you, SCP Euro. So it's pretty convenient on their site. Sorry about the glare. Basically, I find the order where I had initially in ordered the ignition coils. I ordered two and one of them just fritzed out. Um, the reason is the lifetime warranty replacement. And then the return order is the one that I just got, which is the very first thing on that list. January 25th, our Zero seven three six eight six nine three one. Fill that out. <sighs> lights fading. Uh, Christmas decorations. Lights are down. Stuff out of there. It's hard to see. I know. Uh, but these are gone. So uh, we're supposed to get rain and ice. So that's why I'm doing it. I had some help. No, I'm almost done. Yeah, getting the day started off with one of those drinks. Computer's booting up. My little tree's still on. My heater's on. It is gray and yucky outside. But here we are. It is an exciting Wednesday morning. I have a demo that I have to lead this afternoon. Not till 3. Um, got a couple of meetings between now and then. And um, I think I'm also on call. I think I'm on call today, of course. I'm always on call when I have to do something like that. Yeah. It's Wednesday. It's going to rain. It's going to rain. And then, like, tomorrow morning, it's going to start icing. And that's the prediction. So we'll just have to see how all of that kind of stuff goes. But all right. Um, I did get my this thing. I already showed you that. Um, but uh, our printer is just still on the fritz. So my wife is going to have to print the things I need to print. The packing slip. So I can actually um, install this one. Ooh, bonk. Um, and then send the old one back. I, the old one's out. I can send it back. So really, I'm just going to send it back in this box. So, um, Okay, dokie. Okay. That's the Wednesday, February 2nd roundup. That's exactly right. It's February. It's, you know, it is the, is the day of the groundhog. Is that February 2nd? I can't remember anything. All right. I should really be drinking water. But I'm not. All right. See you. Bye. That was too much talking. Dry off because I got the heat of on it, but it's pretty wet down here. 
I had a towel down catching it, but you know that just catches it, so. I can't tell if it's still dripping. And you? As predicted, yesterday's rain turned into today's ice. Well, we've shoveled this twice, two times, salted it now, but look at this clean windshield. <laughs> and look at my driveway that has been shoveled once. And the cars. It's fantastic though, so I'm going to enjoy it. Now I'm going to go eat dinner. That was fun. I did, I had some help, and help. You saw that. Well, it's snowing again. It's hard to see. But it's definitely snowing on top of the sedit and ice. Our friend George is in town just for the weekend. So uh, we made guacamole and played euchre and hung out on this lovely wintry evening. And then tomorrow we're gonna play a bunch of volleyball. Unburied one wiper from this vehicle, as you can see, but it is um, work to try to get through this stuff. It's Saturday morning, and why not? Let's get these cars cleaned off so the sun can do its job. Ooh, there I am. See me? I'm over there. Uh, we got some nice light fluffy snow on top of the vehicle. Much time brushing off, but the <laughs> it's ice all the way up to the crossbars, the luggage rack. So <laughs> as you can see, um, I just you know if we're gonna drive the car, you always want to clean off the top. Of course, I've said this before since I've been doing this bloggy thing for a couple of years. Um, you don't want the snow blowing on your back windshield and on the people behind you. So it's a courteous thing to do, but I'm not gonna be able to get all that ice off of there. No way. No <laughs> way. Typical of me, it was quiet and the birds were making a lot of noise. And then by the time I realized I should shoot a little video of it, suddenly there's cars going by all the time and you can't hear. There we go. All right, last car to clean off and then I'm gonna let the sun do its work. I know I've mentioned it before that the long, lovely hair that my wife and daughter have comes with this kind of curse. <laughs> and the ice on her windshield is a long, dark hair.
This is a gift for a friend, uh, the wife of the friend who stayed with us this weekend. And I'm putting it in a mailbox so he can pick it up tomorrow. And now I'm lit up so this car can see me. All right, see ya. Yeah, we uh, played volleyball. Not a whole lot, but we were there for like eight hours, which was ridiculous. So that was fun. And now it's time to go to bed. So that was Saturday. See you, bye. Well, here we are. It is Sunday morning, and I am headed off to church. Well, we didn't rehearse, of course, on Thursday because of the winter storm, but we are singing a couple of songs that are familiar. I actually just listened to one here in the car. It's a, um, something that the church choir has up on YouTube. Have I ever mentioned, even mentioned that? That there are hundreds of anthems that my church choir has performed over the years that uh, are up on YouTube. One of our choir members used to you know, basically cut them from the video of the service and then post them up so that we had that reference library there back in the day. And our choir director back in the day was like, I'm sure about that. Um, and then, yeah, you know, it's the modern world and the modern world has since come past that. Now we don't do that anymore. He's not in the choir anymore, that particular guy. And we don't um, broadcast the service the same way that we used to. We used to have that video file that he could edit. Um, I have done it occasionally, but you know what I do, don't you? Right? I just uh, do a screen recording on my phone while playing the anthem from our Facebook live stream. All right, it's a beautiful sunny Sunday. It's actually supposed to warm up considerably today, although I haven't seen the weather in a couple of days. We were, you know, at volleyball quite late last night. Um, and uh, it was an interesting little tournament. They always are when they do those kind of uh, things. And it was a benefit for a family that lost their lost a father um, due to COVID. And so it's just the wife and her couple of sons. And so we raised a ton of money for her. But, uh, you know, you just, you sit. And we played a little bit of Euchre, but then it didn't work out that way either. And you just sit waiting for the games. In the first four hours, we played four single games, like single matches of... Uh, a volleyball uh, in the pool play as they call it four games in four and a half hours uh, which was also then a little frustrating that we ended up being there so late and we were the second to last game to play in our then bracket which was interesting so the losers of the game have to ref the next game well that meant I had to stay and ref uh, you know just basically you're just doing the scoreboard uh, the the final match, but the final match is not just a single set, right? It's actually two sets, potentially three, if you know there's the tiebreakers needed. So so we were there pretty late, and then <laughs> my daughter and her boyfriend left because they could, because they weren't stuck in the rest down and waiting for me, because we all took one car. Uh, she accidentally had our keys uh, because she had gone out to get something out of the van. So uh, her boyfriend actually came back up with the key so that we could go back home. All right, that's uh, the Sunday, February, whatever it is, um, update, 6th, 7th, 7th, 8th, 7th, 7th. All right, uh, make your day what you want your day to be. We will talk later. Here we are in scenic Hyde Park here at, uh, you know, the church, Gracie Avenue. <laughs> Completely com covered in snow still. I was all the way down below when I came up the hill completely snow covered. Luckily, observatory here is not.